Welcome back. It's 445 and happy Friday to you. We are waking up with rain in the forecast and luckily we do have rain in the forecast basically every single day over the next seven. Now no particular day is looking like a complete washout, but notice the rain chances. They trend higher into next week. That's as we get some tropical moisture heading our way. So a 30% chance for your Friday already watching a couple showers down into Eastern St. Bernard and Lower Plaquemines Parish. You can see the North Shore and in the Metro. There's really not a whole lot going on right now, but we do have some heavier showers that are slowly moving in off the sounds here and moving into parts of of our viewing area. So a couple showers down here. That's about the extent of it right now. I do think there could be a few additional showers through the morning and this afternoon, but it's not going to be a washout today. It will be quite warm at 92 and humidity. It's getting slightly higher. Same thing into the weekend here. A 30% chance of rain on Saturday and a 40% chance of rain as we head into Sunday. Now our rain chances over the next couple of days are going to be influenced by this upper level low spitting uh, tens of thousands of feet up. It's currently sitting over the northern Gulf and it's going to be moving to the west. So as it moves to the west, it's going to start to bring this rain along the Gulf Coast with it. Now we're right on the edge of it, so we are going to likely see these scattered showers and storms across the area, but there's going to be some breaks mixed in. So watch your low pressure here. Notice some scattered showers wrapping around the northern side of it. That will continue to slide towards the west. You can see there Sunday, probably the greatest coverage of scattered showers, but at the same token, or at the same time, there are plenty of dry times mixing in. Now, as this upper level low backs away, replacing it and coming in behind it is tropical moisture. And this is our tropical wave we've been tracking. It's currently situated anywhere from Jamaica up through Cuba and up through the Bahamas. You can see that long stretch of moisture with some morning showers and storms down there. So this is going to be heading towards the Gulf as we head into this weekend. Here we are Saturday. Here we are Sunday. And then as we get into early next week, that continues to pile up in the Gulf of Mexico. This is when we could see some minor low pressure developing. Models are still not going off the charts with this thing. Some some models don't even have it existing, but I do think we will see increasing chances for some rain maybe into Tuesday and Wednesday of next week as this tropical moisture begins to approach our area. Now, just how much it organizes is still in question. And also, where does that deepest tropical moisture go? Notice it could get close to us, especially around Wednesday. So this could increase our rain chances some. Just got to kind of see how it plays out. We will keep an eye on this. We certainly need the rain. We've been talking about how dry it's been over the past about three, three and a half weeks or so. We have not been getting much rain. It's been mainly about the heat. So some rain, it'll knock our temperatures down. Notice we got a lot of low 90s in the forecast, even a couple days where we may stay in the upper 80s if we have enough cloud cover, if we have enough passing showers. So a couple showers today and tomorrow. I think Sunday is going to be the best shot here this weekend. So if you've outdoor plans this weekend, I think Sunday is when you could see more of those scattered showers and storms around. And then into next week, we're going to be keeping an eye on that tropical moisture. If we do see some heavier rain from it, it would be about mid next week. So Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, we'll be watching for some of those showers. Brandon.